In this problem, we will be constructing triangle ABC given the certain lengths of all three sides. The side lengths we have are AB at 6 centimeters, AC at 5 centimeters, and BC at 4 centimeters. The tools that we're going to use are a protractor, a ruler, and a compass. But our first step will be to draw a line AB at 6 centimeters. So I take my ruler and we draw a 6 centimeter line like so and label it AB and also mark it with 6 centimeters. Step two is to get out our compass and uh, set the compass. How you set your compass is you load a, um, a pencil in and you find the length of the next side and that one's going to be five centimeters. So I line up my compass with my ruler to five centimeters. The point between the tip and the pencil is five centimeters. <clears throat> I'm just double checking with the ruler. Yep, from point to point is five centimeters. Then what we're going to do is put the point on A and draw an arc. That will later become an intersection, but we are going to wait and see. Step three is going to be to set the compass to four centimeters because that's the length of the other side. We have a six centimeter, a five centimeter, and a four centimeter. We're gonna set our compass to four centimeters, shaving one centimeter off the last measurement. The tip to the pencil is four centimeters long. And double checking with the ruler, yep, four centimeters. This time we're doing BC, which means we will put the point on B and draw an arc. Here's where the magic happens. Where those two lines intersect, that becomes our third point. Right there. That becomes our intersection of the two arcs and we can label that and connect it with our other line AB and that line there would be our five centimeter and connecting the intersection with point B four centimeters and we need to remember to label that C. Let's bump it up. We can also add angles. For that you'll need your protractor we put our protractor on point A, we can measure angle A, which is 40 degrees, and we want to record all our thinking. Angle CAB equals 40 degrees. Next, we're going to measure angle B, you might have to extend your line so that the line meets the, the protractor. And we can just see here that angle ABC is 55 degrees. So we can record that down below. ABC equals 55 degrees. And here's where we could do one of two things. We know that each triangle has total degrees of 180. 
So therefore, we can say 180 minus those two degrees added up together. So minus 40 and minus 55. Or we can add them up together and say 180 minus 95, which will give us 85 degrees. Therefore, we can check and 85 degrees. Angle ACB equals 85 degrees. Just like everything else in math, we should double check using our protractor. Again, we might have to extend that line a little bit so that our, our protractor meets the degree symbol and measuring along the baseline all the way up it is in fact 85 degrees. Now let's add some details about our triangle. Triangle ABC, hmm, well it's an acute triangle. Why? Because all the angles are acute. Forty degrees, fifty five degrees, and eighty five degrees. Those are all acute because they are less than ninety degrees. We can also say that triangle ABC is a scalene triangle because all the side lengths are different. And voila, that is how we construct triangle ABC with sides AB 6 centimeters, AC 5 centimeters, and BC 4 centimeters. Good luck with constructing your triangle.